Despite the fact that the body metal is of good quality, nevertheless, on cars older than 7 years, corrosion is a common occurrence, especially for cars that are operated in large cities, where in the winter the road is abundantly sprinkled with reagents. First of all, the thresholds, wheel edges and drunk lead begin to rust. Also subject to corrosion and engine number. The windshield is very weak, as a result, chips and cracks appear on it very quickly. Headlights are another weak point, their protective plastic becomes cloudy, and after 3-4 years, the reflectors begin to peel off. 116 horsepower. There is also a diesel version of the car, but they are also never found on the secondary market. As experience has shown, the 1.5 engine is very reliable and easy to maintain. The 1.8 engine is also reliable, but over time it starts to eat up oil and quite a lot, up to 0.5 liters per 1000 km. Both motors are equipped with a timing chain drive, the metal chain has a fairly long resource, 250,000 km, but after 100,000 km it requires special attention, as it can stretch at any time. Ring and sound when starting the engine and diesel rumble at idle will serve as the signals of the need for an urgent replacement of the chain. Gasoline engines are not picky about fuel quality and can run on 90-second gasoline without problems. Most of these cars have considerable millage, and if the engine starts to run unevenly, then most likely the injection system is simply clogged. To avoid such problems, it is recommended to flush the injection system every 30,000 km. The valve mechanism is not equipped with hydraulic compensators, although the adjustment of the thermal clearances of the valves is usually carried out when repairing the cylinder head. As for cars with engines of not the latest design, fuel consumption is relatively small – 8-10 liters per 100 km in urban mode, on the highway 6-7 liters per 100. A 5-speed manual gearbox is standard for the entire range of gasoline engines. A 1.8 petrol engine can also be equipped with a 4-speed automatic, but such instances are very rare with us. In the vast majority of cases, there are no complaints about the operation of a mechanical transmission, even on cars with a millage of 150 to 100,000 km. The original clutch, with careful operation, on average serves 70-80,000 km. If the gear starts to shift hard in the mechanics, this is the first sign that the box will soon need expensive repairs. With the operational shortcomings, a fuzzy reverse gear engagement can be noted. There are practically no negative reviews about the reliability of automatic transmissions, perhaps this is due to the fact that cars with automatic transmission are not in great demand. In terms of comfort and driving pleasure, the chassis is well designed, but for many motorists, its life is no less important. But even in this component, Nissan Almera will not disappoint, only traditionally expensive original spare parts spoil the picture, but if you spend time looking for a non-original, you can save a lot. Equipped with a stabilizer bar. But after 100,000 km, the suspension begins to slowly crumble. Check absorbers will be the first to be asked for replacement, on a run of 100-130,000 km, wheel bearings and silent blocks will have to be replaced on a run of 80-120,000 km. If you go around the pits and hatches, the ball bearings will last up to 150,000 km, they change as an assembly with levers. The steering of a car is quite problematic, for example, rail repairs have to be done, on average, once every 50,000 km. Steering rods and tips can withstand about 100,000 km of run without any problems. The brake system does not cause any remarks, the pads run 40-50,000 km, the discs up to 100,000 km. If you are the owner of this car model, please describe the problems that you had to face during the operation of the car. Perhaps it is your review that will help readers of our site when choosing a car.